Hi guys, it's your girl here, Love in the City. Welcome to my channel today. I just wanted to jump on real quick and share with you guys this little Amazon haul. I got uh, uh, some jewelry and I got some fabulous hair cutting shears. I called my accessories too just because how they're made. I'm going to share that with you too. So let's just jump right in. As you can see on this nice mannequin that I thrifted from the, the Goodwill. Yes, $4.54. What? I can't believe it's been sitting in my room still with the tag on it for a year and I'm just now using it because what? It's been waiting for the fabulous piece right here to hang on the dial. And so, yeah. Uh, I didn't have anything spectacular. I was waiting. So I, up, yeah. I was waiting for something spectacular to place on it and now I have the perfect thing. But this necklace, look at this, uh, this estate necklace right here. Is that not fabulous? Come on, you, you, you gotta know that's fabulous. And the price is even more fabulous. I like this so much, I bought two, but I'm gonna show you the gold one first. I bought one in each tone, honey. If they had a third tone, I'd have got that one too. <laughs> but yeah, cause you know, I like, you know, I like the, the nice big jewelry. You know, I just do. I just, I love custom jewelry, but anyway. I have some real jewelry, but uh, you know, I switch up all the time and I don't just wear one particular thing. So here we go with this. This, I, I well, I'm gonna tell you what. One necklace was $709 and the other one was $759. And I actually forget which one was which. I don't know if the gold tone was $759 or the silver was $709, but hey, look it up. Sorry, I don't have a direct link, but I will leave the information down below. So you can look it up and get one for yourself, girlfriends. But yeah, I don't know why this one want to keep moving around. But anyway, um, that is, uh, I love that color combination. The red and the light blue and the turquoise. And uh, yeah, I tend to, you know, draw to that because uh, aquamarine turquoise, that, that's my... Uh, my first on is born on Christmas Day, but yeah, I tend to gravitate to tones with that color in it, but I thought that was absolutely fabulous. Yes, you can't beat that for seven something. I just knew when I clicked it, I'm like, okay, they're going to want like $30, whatever. I, I saw $7 and change, and I, let me tell you, I couldn't click that thing fast enough to put it in the basket, and then I saw it had a partner. So let's move this off you guys and here is the silver and this is just perfect because I went thrifting the other day and you guys are probably going to see that video next for me some thrifting I got some fabulous estate pieces as well you know your girl just looked up but anyway I happen to thrift some earrings that are silver and turquoise what this is giving me that bohemian uh, Indian vibe uh, right here, honey. Look at that. Is that not fabulous? <laughs> yes. And it's got the lion head on each one here. One, two, three lions. And then you got your little teardrops here. And then you got your, 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 uh, that's what I'm looking for. Your, your wow factor right here. I like that it drops down really low. It's really, really nice. Look at that. Yes, hunties. That is awesome. I hope you like it. I do. All right. We're going to leave her right here. So you guys can keep feasting your eyes on it. But yeah, you can. And it's nice and heavy. It's not too heavy where it would be cumbersome on you. But it's got a little weight to it. So that's the part that I like that I was really surprised that it had you know a little prominence a little weight to it which is awesome so yeah you know summer is coming up soon and your girl is gonna be what looking nice okay I'm gonna reach across here guys sorry about that to bring it closer to me I thought I had it in an awesome place but let's just okay we'll put this one right here because we'll show one at a time look at that I wish I could hook it on, but I can't. But these earrings, I'm telling you guys, this camera is not even showing you the bling of it all. 
I'm talking about prominent students. Let me bring it a little bit closer to the camera. Okay. There we go. Y'all yeah, see a little bit of that bloom. What? Fabulous. These were in me $9. I think a nine cents. And I'm gonna get they have a gold pair. I'm gonna go back and get the gold pair. But I wanted to see how I didn't realize how they bling so so I figured oh, it's gonna look good with the gold, but this is the silver. But honey, I'm talking about sparkle for your life. This camera, this cannon ain't even showing y'all the realness of it all. I'm talking about it looks like I'm dripping in diamonds. It looks like it's real and not costume jewelry. But they're not for that. But they look real, honey. These are called um I believe these are called Starburst. All right, and then I'm gonna move on to the next. Let's see. All right, I forgot to tell you guys, you probably saw it yourself, but it is the fish eye hook on there. Yeah, I don't like anything that's gonna snap permanently on my ear because I'm just, I don't know, years, years, years ago, about 20 something years ago, I had a hearing. I was only snatched out of my ear. I was at my girlfriend's house and her little boy uh, was, you know, a little kid was playing with me and jump, you know, playing in my lap and my earring got caught on the sweater and ripped my ear. Lord, I had to have constructive surgery on my ear because that's just, you know, I wasn't having it. But anyway, I actually I walked around a couple years with my ear split like that. I used to wear clip-ons and I just couldn't stand how the clip-ons pinch. But anyway, long story short, I got the surgery went to the cause uh, medic surgeon you know where you go get your boobs and stuff done that's if you have a rip in your ear honey but back then I only paid three hundred dollars ain't no telling what it is now 2018 this was like whew. oh my god this had to be like 97 maybe 96 I think I got it done in 96 1996 yeah that's a long time ago y'all but yeah, yeah, I paid 300 and ain't no telling what it is now. But they stitched my ear back together and then I had to wait like six weeks to uh, re-pierce my ear. And uh, yeah, you can't even tell that my ear ring was ripped through my ear because I'm, I'm not walking around like that. But anyway, here uh, are another pair of fish hook. And these, I think these were about the same price. This has sparkle and brilliance to it too. Like, like I said, the camera ain't even showing it up justice. But um, I thought it was different. I don't have anything like that. It's like the star, the star in the moon, and you got the star in the moon here, and then it's like, and it looks like an antique gold and black and that uh, color combination. And I actually got a dress that has this color combination in it. Cause I was like, wow, I never paid attention to that. They didn't have a color combination like that or putting things together like that so now I know I can't just buy the rings alone that I won't look crazy but uh, yeah these are super super nice and at the end it drops down the half moon and the stars not fabulous yes okay guys now I don't know if you're new to my channel or not you've probably seen where I uh, have decided to take uh, the wig off and just rock my own hair. I have four pairs of earrings here that I'm gonna show you. These are sterling silver and they shine too, but I'm not sure the camera ain't even picking it up. Let's see if I can get it to focus. Come on, camera focus. Right. Yeah, like it doesn't want to focus for some reason. Maybe too close to it. But anywho, uh, the setting inside is uh, the bezel set because I didn't want, and they have several ones, I didn't want the ones that uh, had the diamond actually sitting out. The one side is just stirring, it's just plain silver. But this side here which faces out. You got that. And uh, the reason why, these are called the hinged huggy uh, earrings. They're like men and women, but uh, I got these because in one ear I have three holes, and in another ear I have four, and the fourth hole is at the very top of my ear. Yeah, I did that a long time ago. But anyway, this is how it snaps. I'm not gonna shoot everything. It has, it's hinged because it, you know, it snaps in real good. It, it ain't going nowhere. 
so I, you know, I can sleep at ease. I can take a shower and use whatever. I wouldn't relax my hair in these just because it may tarnish it a little bit, but it usually comes right back. Uh, if you, uh, I think one time I let it sit in some uh, toothpaste, toothpaste and water, whatever, and uh, it brought it the brilliance back. But I know just to take them out, I'm gonna relax my hair. But I got them all clipped together like this because I have three earrings in one ear and in here a four. And they were actually like five something a piece, but I bought four pairs. So I have an extra hoop case, I lose one. But they're all 10 if you want in what size it is because I like it very small. Uh, this is a 10 millimeter because I don't want it real big. And like I said, my hair is like cut into the, sh uh, well I cut my own hair. I cut it to like a short uh, 1920s bob, so, and I have all my, my little hoops here for my ears. Okay guys, here is the piece of resistance. This is the end of the video because I know the talk for a minute. But this uh, here holds my hair cutting shears. I have the thinning shears and I have the, the, the regular shears and I have the, the set. And look at that bling on the scissors. Can you see the bling? I don't even know if you can see the bling. It's like a hot pink diamond inside. And then you got the white diamond around it. And uh, this this is called dragon head because it's like a little dragon on the end. Let me take one out for you. Let's see this one is the easiest. These are seriously sharp. I've already cut my finger. <laughs> um, trim because I actually trimmed uh, I, my hair in the back. I have to keep it. I like to keep it tapered. And so I actually use these to taper it and the bag there to take out the bulk because you don't want that bulky look. I like my uh, balls to be tight and head hugging because I got a little pee head. But anyway, I like it to be tight and head hugging. So I use this for the back mm -hmm. to shape and to take out bulk hair is what these are for. I don't and know if you can see the dragon. Dollars for this camera and doing things like this. I want my six hundred dollars back for this, but I pay for this camera that ain't focused. It's pissing me off. But anyway, I digress. But yeah, these are seriously, seriously sharp. As you can see that you got the, the Japanese, Korean, mm -hmm. African, Korean symbol on it. I'm so sorry, y'all, for this ain't focusing. But uh, yeah, it's the dragon head. These are six inches, and they are not light. They're like really heavy here, which is good. So you got that, and then all from your You got your the suede cloth. I usually use that to wipe my blades off after I'm done trimming. Right here, actually, I have another pair that are like pink, seriously hot pink. And I use those to, uh, I cut my husband's hair too. I don't know if y'all know my husband, Paul, he Caucasian. But anyway, I cut his hair, he, he don't go in my shop. I cut his hair. And I just wanted to get some extra shears for myself because, you know, he has a beard. And I used to hit the scissors, which are still sharp, uh, that I other pair that have to him, but they don't have no diamond. Well, they got like a little stone inside, but they don't, they're not blinged out like these right here. And they're a little bit longer, but these are perfect. For me, and let's see the dragon head. So, nice. It's kind of like a purplish, hot pink tone. A little teal in there. So yeah, I'm gonna push it to the teal. But yeah, those are nice. Okay guys, this is the end of my video. It is super long now. I didn't mean for it to be 14 minutes. But you know what happens when you get to chit-chatting. And uh, I hope you guys like this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys later. Bye!